Hi, everybody. Welcome to day 24 of Inktam Inktober Tangles. I'm Danny. Uh, if this is your first video, I've been working for the month of October in my journal with Posca marker pens and Neo Color 2 water soluble crayons. I'm happy to have you here with me. I hope you subscribe to my channel and like this video. So today is Jessica's Heart and it's by Randy Jameson. And we're gonna start with a line. I'm gonna do it on an angle here just for having a little bit more space. So I'm gonna start with a line that I'm going to be working off of and I'm going to make little crescent moon shapes going across. From here, where they dip down and make a valley, I'm going to add a line coming up. From corner to corner, going to the middle of the little mountain crescent moon shape, I'm going to make a V. is the end of this pen. This will be garbage after this. And then I'm going to make parts at the top. So I'm going to curve over the top part of it. So they can all be different heights. So I'm going to come around and make the top part of a heart. If you had different heights, then the how they fall would look different. They wouldn't be touching quite as much. So you can add some variations to it. On her site, there is more variations, but I'm gonna keep it like this for this video. I'm gonna add this into one of the petals. And again, I wanna start today with the Neo color and outline the outside, just so um, I feel like from my hands going over the paper, the white's fading a little bit and it's a little hard to see on the camera. So I'm gonna start with that. And I'm gonna take my, I'm gonna start with my red Posca cause I have in this flower quite a bit of red. So I wanna keep along the same track here. And I'm going to, I almost feel like I'm going to use the bottom of the petal as the line. So rather than drawing the line, I'm going to use that. So I'll start my crescent moons. I'm not going to have that many because this petal is very small. And I'm going to have my lines coming up here. I probably wouldn't see it. I'm going to start with the middle one where it's obvious coming in with my V and coming up with the top part of the heart. And then next to it, I'll have my V going off in space and then coming up V and bringing the top. So that would be my design. And I'm going to take my orange Posca as well and I'm going to, I'm going to just, because I just want another color in here, I'm going to add a second aura. So she, you know, this isn't necessarily in her step out. That's just what I'm doing. Just feel like it needs something else and maybe just the center part. All right, so we want that to be dry um, and I'm going to add a little bit of shading in the back. I'm going to take the darker orange here and add a little bit of shading. And I'm going to take some red with my Neo color and just on one side of the um, triangular shapes that are being created here, I'm going to add a little bit of red. And I'm going to take my yellow and add a little bit of a yellow to the hearts. And the lighter part here, and maybe even a little bit in here. Okay. 
And ending with my white Posca, I'm gonna add a little bit of highlights. So a little curve perhaps on the hearts, maybe a little bit on the arches. Okay, that's it. Nice and quick and simple. This is something you can spend literally five minutes, just five minutes a day creating. Give yourself five minutes of relaxation and time to yourself just to reju reju rejuvenate yourself. All right, guys, I'll see you tomorrow on day 25.